guys, welcome back to my channel and I am back. I haven't been in my studio in about two weeks because you guys already know I've been traveling, but I'm so happy to be back and to bring you this video because this video has oh, I've been meaning to film, but when I got tagged in it, I was literally getting ready to get on an airplane and um, go travel. So, and I wanted to sit down and think about these questions. Again, um, from the title, you guys already know, it is a video about to get to know my channel a little bit more and a little bit more of me and where I'm at um, regarding my channel. So, this video I was tagged in by a friend of mine which is, her name is Marlo Keenan. I will leave her channel and uh, her video down below in the description and I'll, t I'll put it up in the cards also. So you guys can go and check it out, check her out. Make sure you subscribe to her channel and just support all of us. And I will also link down below the original um, YouTuber that I guess started the idea or came up with the idea. I will link their their um channel as well down below so this is um get to know my channel tag and so you guys are gonna get to know a little bit more about how i do things where i'm at um how i plan and all of that stuff so but before we get started make sure you subscribe to my channel like this video hit the notification bell so you're notified every time i upload and uh, make sure to uh, leave me a comment down below if you guys like these kind of videos, what content you want to see next because that's literally based off of, my content is literally based off of what you guys like and what I think you guys might like. So let me know in the comments below or just let me know how you're doing. Like, how are you? How are you? How are you? Let me know. All right, let's get into the video. All right, so I do have the questions. There is fifth, uh, 14 questions. I do have them on my phone, so here we go. The first one is, what is your content based on? So my content is, I started out with makeup, and I love makeup, and it will always be part of my channel, but um, my content's a little bit everywhere. Not everywhere, but it's a little bit of everything. Um, I wanted to do a little bit of everything vlog vlogging makeup um lifestyle videos just about me and my life and i want to show share that with you guys so my content is a little bit of everything um about me so that is what my channel is about and i hope you guys enjoy that the next question is why did you pick the types of videos to create so again like i said um I picked them based off of my interests and also I picked them because I want to share my life with my my community, my subscribers, which are you, you guys are my family. That is how I, um, I pick the types of videos that I do. I know you guys want to be more involved and I want to make those videos for you guys so you guys can be more involved in my life. Um, and also you... I usually focus more on makeup, but I will be focusing more on other, other, um, on other topics like clothing and all of that. So, next question is, what makes you different than other channels in the same genre? Is it genre? Yeah. Um, what makes me different? Um, I think. I don't think there's a specific thing that makes me different. I feel like we all bring something different. We all have different lifestyles. We all have different experiences. But my goal is to share my experiences and to let my let my community, my little family that I've created here on YouTube, um, know that I am just like you guys. You know, I struggle. I um, go through emotions mentally, physically and um emotionally so i i just want to share that with you guys and i want you guys to know that i'm just like you guys like i go through 
the same things that everybody goes through and I want to show that more on my channel for you guys so I think I bring something different everybody else brings something different so you can relate to somebody and in any type of way I think we all have something that you can relate to so I hope that answers the question question four is what is your most viewed video so my most viewed video um, I did kind of go through my videos and it was the ultimate the Jeffree Star ultimate mystery box unboxing that video has three point three thousand three point six K views um, so I mean I guess people like that video and it was more like showing what was in the box so I guess that's why it did well so next question is um, number five videos that you are the most proud of so my vid the videos that I'm most proud of as of right now has to be my Spanish videos um, why because those videos are actually a little bit harder for me to make because um, yes I'm fluent in Spanish yes I speak Spanish on the daily um, it is my primary language however I do speak English 90% of my life or my daily life so when it comes to Spanish videos I do have I do have to do a little bit more research and a little bit more concentration and um, I put a lot of effort into those Spanish videos it, I'm not saying that the English ones I don't but the Spanish videos I, I do have to put more effort into those because of the language make sure people are understanding me so those are the videos I'm most proud of um, number six what top three videos should people watch to get the best idea of who you are so in the, for this question I can say my vlogs my Q and A's and um, probably it, it's funny to say, but like my unboxings, that's most of um, where you're gonna get more of who I am. Like my Q and A's, I'm gonna tell you, like I'm gonna answer questions you guys might wanna know about me. And then my vlogs, you're gonna see my personality in my vlog. So that's who I am and I mean, I don't put on a show for you guys, but that the, my vlogs will be the number one thing you, if you want to get to know me, my vlogs and my Q and A's, and kind of like these tag videos because I like doing them. Like I put I put effort and I think about these things, so um, those probably have to be uh, the, the top three types of videos you can watch about me. And then once this one's up, this one. Um, number seven is what improvements or or ideas have you done to try and grow your channel so this is actually a good question because I am constantly behind behind the scenes I am constantly making improvements either it, it could be lighting it could be background it could be uh, technology and my cameras, um, content. Um, I am constantly improving things behind the scenes. Definitely not something I film because um, I don't know. I might film them one day and see, bring you guys along and see what types of things that I think about, what types of things, ideas, and improvements I'm making. I'm constantly making improvements to my channel. I promote it. Um, Again, I do the lighting, the camera, the editing, all of that is improvements that I'm constantly doing. So, and I'm constantly on the go. So, I hope you guys can see those things. Um, I do put a lot of effort into improving either my ideas, my content, well, my ideas um, regarding anything, my videos or my lighting or my cameras and stuff like that. Um... So I hope that answers. I'm constantly making improvements. Um, number eight. Is this a hobby or something you'd like to do full time? So 
For those of you that don't know me, I do work a full-time job um, during the day. And I do do, do I do do YouTube full-time as well. So I do work my full-time job and I come back, I come home and I'm working YouTube. So I consider this another full-time job, but again, if so I consider myself working two jobs at the same time, but um, it did start out as a hobby for me, something for me to do after work, something um, to keep me busy. Now I am completely busy and do I want to make this my one and only full-time job? Absolutely. That is definitely my goal. And why? Because I want to focus 100% on YouTube and make the make this a great experience for everybody so do i want to make it a full-time job absolutely um we'll see what the future holds and i hope that answers that question um question number nine video ideas have you never filmed or posted but really wanted to okay so um i really in the near in the near future videos ideas that i want to post is um videos with my family because if you guys don't know I'm very family oriented and um, they are always with me 100% so video ideas that I have I haven't filmed but will be filming soon hopefully will be videos with my family so hopefully they're going to be fun videos and um, yeah I'm, ex I, I'm actually excited for those but we just haven't they um, they just haven't gotten um used to being on camera so those are those are videos that will be coming up hopefully soon next question is <clears throat> overall goals for your channel so i want to definitely um continue the content that i'm doing um mostly i do it for you guys so I want you guys to get to know my life and get to know me more and um, I just I just want us to be successful together learn together go on this journey together and um, my overall goal for my channel is to grow to grow with an organic community and organic um, subscribers so I want people that actually follow me and subscribe to me, actually watching my videos and actually enjoying them. Um, not, I'm not saying that I don't want subscribers that don't watch my videos and that don't support me, but those are also welcome. I welcome everybody, um, but I think my overall goal is for us to be successful, to always be together, be positive, um, stay away from the negativity, and... Let's just grow together. All right, so the next question is, what are the best reasons for a viewer to subscribe to your channel? So um, this is kind of hard because I'm really, it's really difficult for me to just kind of like put, say, you know, subscribe to me. But um, I think if you do subscribe to me, um, you're going to get a real me. You're going to get somebody honest. Someone that's actually going to interact with you will, um, if you want to ever talk, you can DM me. I am available for you. Um, I don't just sit here and do the videos and um, never respond to you. So I'm here because of you guys and you'll always have a community with us. I will always be um, engaging and I will always be there for you guys. So the next question is a video that got a lot of views that you didn't expect. Um, it would have to be the Jeffree Star video, um, the unboxing. That video got a lot of views and I really, why, I didn't really think it was going to. Why? Because even if, even if it was a hot topic at the time, I didn't think it was going to get enough uh, or enough views or just view that much views was because 
at the time everybody was uploading that that unboxing of that box so I said you know I am grateful for any views at all so to get that many views I was through the roof I was so happy um, but that that video I didn't expect to get that much views um, Question 13, videos you thought would have gotten more views but didn't. This is a great question. I think for this question, it will have to be my Spanish videos. Um, I know I'm not the greatest at Spanish. However, I did think those were going to do a lot better. And, you know, I, I'm still positive about the future videos that are going to come out, that I'm going to come out with in Spanish. So... Um, I don't lose hope. I keep going. I keep pushing. So I did think those were going to be the most viewed videos, but that is fine. Um, question 14. What makes you, what makes you excited about creating new content? Um, what makes me excited? You know, I get happy from the beginning, getting my, starting put, uh, to, just sitting down and start start doing my makeup, setting up my whole my whole lighting system, my whole my whole um, studio. That gets me excited, and the fact that I can sit down and just talk to you guys, just just talk, and I like that. You know, um, it's just me in here, of course, but you guys make me excited. You know, the comments that you guys leave me. Those things make me excited. The the um, type of content that I, content that I make make me excited. So, you know, I, I'm it's the little bit it's the little things for me that make me excited. You know, so I enjoy it. I I get so happy to sit down. And I, the only thing I can tell you is that when I do sit down and film, it's because I am in the right mindset. And I am in a good emotional place where I am happy and I am filming and I am in a good mood, let's just say. Because that makes me excited. Like I want to be in the best mood to film because that's the true me. And um, my videos come out better that way. You guys can see my true personality and I love it. And I, and I get so excited to upload these videos like I from the start when I tell you I when I'm getting ready for the video to the last minute that I upload the video makes me excited and when that first comment comes through that first like any of that that makes me excited so it's the small things for me that get me excited um the last question is tag and link three other channels to do this tag to help spread the word Okay, so I will be tagging three of my friends down below in the description um, box. So check those out. Um, check their channels out as well. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope you guys have a little bit more sense of who I am and how my channel is growing and how, how I drive my channel. And yeah. Thank you so much for watching and um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell so you're notified every time I upload. Like this video and leave me a comment letting me know if you like the video, if you like these kind of videos so I can have an idea to make more. And yeah, thank you so much for your support and I love y'all. Bye guys.